Hey everybody, I went to my favorite store again, my Sharp Shopper store, and they had some deals for this sassy gal shopper. I can't wait to show you, stay tuned. Hey everybody, what's prepping? If this is your first time here, this is a Sharp Shopper haul. And Sharp Shopper is a grocery outlet that is kind of regional. It's kind of in the mid-Atlantic region of the United States. Um, and I will leave a link down below where you can see if there is a Sharp Shopper near you. But it is a grocery outlet and it does get overflow from stores that are trying to move stock that might be close to an expiration date. Um, or they just need to just need to move the stock. Uh, grocery hauls are random a lot, but there are some things that I see there on a regular basis. When I do a pantry stock up, I am doing a pantry stock up that is from a working pantry. What I put away is what I eat. <laughs> um, on occasion, I will find things, I'll find canned goods there that I can uh, put downstairs where I have more of a longer term storage downstairs, but I do use those. I, I have always stocked up, have created a stockpile so that I can buy foods that I use on a regular basis at a low discount price. And then I don't ever have to pay full price. Over the years, I have saved more money than trying to use a double coupon at a regular grocery store. So that's what I've done for a long time is just building that stockpile so that I can shop from my stockpile. We're gonna go ahead and start with some of the items down uh, here on my floor and then I'm just gonna work across the island and onto the table and I'll show you what I got. Okay, we're gonna start right here with two cases of water. These were each $2.19 for the case. So that was a good deal. So we picked up two cases there. I like energy drinks. I don't drink a lot of them, but the Bang brand has zero sugar in it and they usually have pretty good flavors. This was $1.99 for four cans. So that is an excellent deal. Their sodas, now name brand sodas, they usually have their $4.99 for the 12 pack, but they also have generic brands that are cheaper, like $2.99 for the pack, but I don't like the flavors because it really is cheap soda. So we go for the regular, this is $4.99 though. And I know this is cheaper than what I've been seeing in the stores. These things are almost $7 in the regular grocery stores and at Walmart. So boom, got a deal there. And then we got another bag of Gala apples. These were $2.99 for the three pound bag. So that was exciting. And then we got these carb balance wraps. And I'm finding that my family enjoys these better than bread. Instead of sandwiches, we'll make wraps. And with these carb balance, if you've never had these before, see how the carbs are on, there's 19 grams of carbs, but most of those carbs are fiber, 15 grams. When they have this much fiber, these are very, very filling. These are 4.49. Now these are on the expensive side, this is a Mission brand but um, we don't eat a lot of these anyway. So unless we're having tacos, we don't go through these a lot. Um, and they do have a long shelf life, so they won't expire as fast as bread does. So there you go. These, this time we're in the freezer section, 79 cents for the salami and Colby Jack. And this is a great snack for me. I just like to have meat and cheese for a snack. By the way, I picked up four of those. That's more for me. Well, I picked up more cheese. My last Sharp Sharper video, I had a lot of cheese in there too. It doesn't take much when we're making homemade pizzas or I made homemade macaroni and cheese. We will go through these fairly quickly. Um, these are $1.69 for um, an eight ounce package. And um, that's still a good deal from what you find in the regular grocery stores. Then this was new, and I love it when they have these. This is Purdue, and these are individually packaged chicken breasts, and these are not thick like you find uh, when you get your packaged chicken and the breasts are like super thick. I slice those in half, which I suggest that you all do as well because one, you'll make it go further, but two, you actually get what a chicken breast size is actually supposed to be. Your chicken breasts are not supposed to be that fat. And so with this, um, I like it because they're free range, they're individually packaged, 
Um, and so this, there are five in each package and it's $3.99. It's a great deal because these would be um, almost $7 in the grocery store because it's it's uh, free range and it's produced. So I got two packages of those. We got this big package, this big container of pepperoni. This was $3.80. This is a better deal than getting a, the Hormel or another name brand package of little pepperonis in the grocery store. And then we use these not just to snack on, but to make um, little personal pizzas that we'll use these on the with uh, English muffins and pizza sauce, cheese, and some pepperonis. So these are perfect for that. Normally at my Sharp Shopper store, this raisin cinnamon bread from Pepperidge Farm is $2.50, or it'll say like two for five. But today, because I guess they're trying to move some stock, it's two for $3. So these were $1.50 for these. That is an excellent deal. You cannot get this deal you know, not even at Costco. Then I found these Red Baron stuffed crust four cheese pizzas. These are $2.99 a piece. So that's going to be fun for a pizza night. And then we can also add some pepperoni to this if we want. Um, bananas. These actually were the best looking ones. Otherwise they were like super green or they were already uh, turning brown. So hopefully these will last a while. And then I found some more of these, just crack an egg. You just, you crack an egg in here. You throw all of the stuff in there, scramble it up and use the microwave. Um, this is the Denver scramble, which is good. It's got vegetables and meat and cheese in it. These were two for a dollar. So I picked up four Then I got this big bag of chicken chunks and I will get one. If I see them, I will get one. We've already went through one bag, so I'm replacing it. This, I have to tell you guys, if you, Cook these in your oven and then add it into this dish. You have one heck of a stick to your ribs meal. I did that this week and I added in, um, I had in a little extra cream because this took up a lot of the extra sauce. So I added in a little bit of um, extra milk and, um, and some cheese in there too. So it was cheesy, creamy chicken and rice. <laughs> And so that this it was great. My family was like, this is the bomb. It was stick to your ribs. We had leftovers. It was awesome. And then the last thing for uh, the frozen and fridge section here is this vegetable pasta. This is only a dollar nineteen. So this was good. The vegetable pasta is for my oldest daughter who has um, some gluten issues, and so we're gonna. Um, try to get her to maybe switch over to a vegetable pasta and see if she likes it. So there you go. When I went to the store today, I was concentrating more on canned goods. I needed to replace a lot of things, especially this chicken noodle soup because we have had some illnesses in our house the last week and I need to replace the chicken noodles. So these are 99 cents a can and they are the bigger cans of soup so this is a really good deal i picked up five of those we saw these little gift card holders they're two for five dollars and i thought these were so cute um one my oldest daughter picked these out because she has some gift cards to give to friends so she got those and i picked up some more of my favorite tea it's 99 cents for this and so we are getting low on one box so we're going to buy another box to replace it and then i picked up some of this black strap molasses i do have a recipe that i'm going to be using molasses in and so i was excited to see if they actually had some of this it's 239 for the jar of molasses then i found cream of chicken soups some more of my cream soups to bake with. These are 99 cents a can. For Campbell's brand of, of 99 cents for that, that's an excellent deal. So I got cream of chicken and four cans of cream of mushroom. I also got four cans of mandarin oranges. These are really good, and I will keep buying these until I can't find them anymore. 79 cents a can. I love mandarin oranges. And then we got uh, two cans of chicken breast. These are $1.60. Oh, no. $1.99. See? They've gone up. They used to be $1.69 a can. I did not pay attention to that when I bought it. <laughs> All right. Then we have uh, two cans of tuna, the albacore tuna. I like this chicken of the sea brand. These are 99 cents. And then they had some 
canned turkey breast. And I thought this was, I've never seen this before there. So that was kind of nice to see, being able to get a different kind of canned meat. So these were 99 cents a piece and I picked up four of those. Uh, let's see, moving back here to the back, I got another bag of the Dynamo gel packs and there's 50 in here. And I have used these since my last visit and I they do a wonderful job. I think these are great. Um, I have used um, anywhere from one to two per load. I have a, um, an HE machine, so you have front loading machine. And so I've just threw two of them in there and they did the job. So I'm very happy to, to keep buying these at $2.99. I'll just keep stocking up on those because they're so super easy, you know, especially when the kids are doing their own laundry, they just pop the thing in there and it's, it's good. All right, then I got four cans of black beans. These are 79 cents a can. Then I got these um, small white beans, just for some variety. These are 99 cents a can. And then I am replenishing some of the green beans that we've used up here in the past uh, two weeks. See, these are 79 cents a can. And I got four of those. Let me tell you a story. I may, <laughs> ever since, oh gosh, it's been a few years now, I give food as a Christmas present, as one of the Christmas presents to my kids. And it's usually the one that is what they're usually having the most of. My daughter likes these these Pringles, anything that's like a, a dill pickle or something that's kind of odd. She likes hot stuff. And so I found these and I'm just gonna go ahead and put them in one of those tall bags and give it to her. My daughter is, my other daughter loves bread and she loves the King's Hawaiian uh, dinner rolls. And so I put those in there and wrap them up. And then my son gets a bottle of Martinelli's juice, which I, I need to find. And, um, and so it's funny because each of them get something that applies to them what they like, you know, kind of like your favorite candy or your favorite thing. And I did it one year and they all just laughed. And so it's been a tradition ever since then. So anyway, there's a little story behind that. <laughs> I got some more Knorr sides, the Knorr rice sides. The, they still have these. These are two for a dollar. So I picked up another um, six because I, two of these, I need two of these for my family of five. Most of the times I really like to try to keep it to two. You know, I'm like hate to talk about rationing food already, but I try to keep it to two for my family and I will throw in meat or some vegetables or some other stirring ideas to make it go a little bit longer. Then we got um, three boxes of instant mashed potatoes. These are $1.99 per box. And the deal this week that they had for shoppers there were two of these boxes, these um, big family size boxes of Life cereal. The Cinnamon Life, these were $4, so these were $2 each. Speaking of cereal, we got some more Raisin Bran. These are $1.99 per box. And then the Safari Cocoa Crunch is 99 cents a box. We get a lot of these. I just keep getting them and throwing them downstairs. And then I picked up two boxes of the uh, Supreme Lemon Bars. My goodness, we love lemon bars. And these are 99 cents each, so we got those. Then I found some more of these trail mixes from Meyer. And again, Meyer is a store that is not in my area. Um, I know it, that it's in Michigan. I used to work at that store when I lived in Michigan. And um, so I got another um, Americana trail mix. This is the, it had the red, white, and blue um, chocolate covered peanuts. And then it has the um, caramel cups and all that stuff. This stuff is the bomb, you guys. And I only saw just a couple bags. So I picked up one, but then this was in there. This camp, uh, the s'mores trail mix. Oh my gosh. Butter toffee peanuts, graham cracker bites. Oh my goodness. I put this out for Christmas or off, uh, at Thanksgiving and we had some people over. I'm telling you, this thing went like that. So this stuff is good. And I bet this is going to be even better with the marshmallows and chocolate and all that. Oh my goodness. We got some, this twin pack of hamburger helper beef pasta is a better deal than buying the boxes by themselves individually. The boxes they had there were 99 cents a piece. And here I'm getting two boxes in the twin pack for $1.49. So I'm saving 50 cents by buying them in the twin pack. Boom, I got three boxes of those. And then I got two boxes of these Triscuits. I got an original one for 99 cents. And I got the cracked pepper and olive oil. Those are so good. Those are 99 cents. I'm gonna have to hide those. 
they had more of the progresso soup mixes i went back and got the creamy corn chowder because i thought it was gone i was so sad because this stuff is so good um so when i went back after i bought this the first time they didn't have any they had uh, a wild rice soup mix and so i got a bunch of those but this for 99 cents i i made I put two of these bags in a crock pot and made the soup for my family and we had leftovers. So this is a really good soup. You can make this go further if you wanted to add more things in it, maybe some beans um, or some extra vegetables, things like that. Um, this, again, these are really good. If you find these, you know, get some of these. These are easy soup starters. And let's see, we got three cans of tomato sauce. These are the eight ounces. These are 39 cents a piece. We got some more cup of soup chicken noodle flavor two for a dollar we got some more seasonings this time i picked up meatloaf seasoning packets and these are 39 cents a piece so i got three of the meatloaf and then i got three of the turkey gravy because yes i did use these for thanksgiving so i need to replace the ones i used they had a bunch of these niagara brand candy bars these are Peanut butter, chocolate. I love peanut butter and chocolate. It's such a weakness. These were five for a dollar. So I got a bunch of these and we're just gonna go ahead and hide those. All right. These uh, freezer bags. Um, I've been going through a lot of these, of course, you know, with stocking and doing things. These have gone up to $1.19. Y'all, these used to be 99 cents. Oh, I'm starting to see prices rise even in my Sharp Shopper store. This is a brand that I see there a lot, Allegra brand. They have elbows, they have egg noodles, and spaghetti pasta. And um, this has gone up. It used to be 69 cents, and it's 89 cents. So still cheaper than a lot of places because sometimes you'll get the box for a dollar at a grocery store or even at the dollar store, okay? It's still cheaper, but it used to be a lot cheaper. So anyway, feeling the pinch these days. How about you? I brought in my reusable bags, as you saw in the, um, probably saw in the thumbnail picture. And I brought in my reusable bags. I used 10 bags and it's five cents a bag. So I saved another 50 cents on my grocery trip today. All right, everybody. That was the haul for this time from Sharp Shopper. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite deal was. Did you see a favorite item at the store? The store is stocked. It's all, you know, the inventory looks good and, um, uh, just just in certain areas, the prices have gone up a little bit, but hey, you know, I'm uh, we'll take it. We'll take any discount we can get right now, right? So listen, um, y'all take care, and until next time, prep it up, pack it up, and stack it up.